uh, we got physical graffiti. I actually shout some love out to Trey. Czar, fourteen dollars all the way from South Africa. Sending love to my boy Trey. Okay, that nigga don't even talk. Yeah, yeah. Damn it. Yeah. Okay. You don't want to show his face? Nothing. So first question on but the they panel. know what you look like from the vlogs. First question right. on the panel, ladies. So, on a first date, give us one thing that will turn you on, and one thing that will turn you off on a first date. And we'll start right here. Okay. So one thing that would turn me off money oh, by any man. Chris, yeah, on. I would say is money. If he talks about how much money he has. Or anything okay. relating to money on the first day that would turn me off. Um, and what would turn me on is just like like actual confidence, like actual innate confidence that comes out of you, like wh whether it be a smile or the way you dress or the way you look, or just your average, like just your general like vibe about you, that turns me on, like your big dick confidence. Um, but if you talk about like anything like monetary that you can count or I can count with my fingers, I don't want to hear that. Um, you can keep that to yourself. Big facts. That turns me off. Facts. So so would you take a guy that doesn't have money then? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I have the money, but you can't Don't talk about so it. So you can't talk about it whatsoever. Okay. Let let the lifestyle do it for you. Yeah, that way you don't go. have to talk about it at all. Show me. Okay, let's Show me, but don't tell me. Okay, fair enough. I'm gonna keep it real. Before we even go on a date, I'm gonna need to see a dick pic because it's 2021 and I'm not wasting my motherfucking time. Okay, <laughs> okay, I fuck with that. Yo, okay, okay. Time. Wait, question though, is it in real time or a picture? A pic, uh, FaceTime or a picture? I don't know because these days, men be catfishing. I need a I video. Find it unfair. The That's a first. Wait, no, I find it unfair. Find catfishing on penis? Zip no, on five. No, no. Yo, you they know. can edit. Oh, you they know you're doing that? Yo, no, no, no. I, I don't that. do it. I, I know all the behind the scenes. You just expose yourself. You just expose nah, yourself. No, no, nigga, I've never sent dip it in my life ever. <laughs> Why? You should. No, nah, just FaceTime. Just FaceTime. Hey, there you go. Fresh, 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 fresh. What? I find it highly unfair. What? No, no, no. Hear me wrong. Hear me out. Hear me out. You gotta send a dick pic for you to be enticed, but there's no way for him to tell how the pussy feels. So it's like it's unfair. Oh, I have reviews. No, okay. no, 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 no. Reviews don't mean nothing. Yeah, like because we don't know if everybody reviewed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I go. Like, I only trust my man. Not everybody like, comes from subways yeah. like, going to review that subway is good. Yeah, that's facts. So it's like. I, that's why I find it unfair. That's all. He's speaking facts, though. Nah, okay. that's facts. Like, so, what, you, what you gonna say to that? <laughs> Listen, you just ask my ex. I'll tell you. No, no, no. no we don't know your ex, ex, though. Yeah, we don't know your ex. Listen, how do you think I'm on? You? Listen, <laughs> we listen. We'll find out. It. We'll find out. Who's we'll next? Who's out. next? Who's next? Okay, and then one thing that um, the other one. Which one? So you said Which um, you they got to see first. Yes. Before they even get to you, but then on a date. What turns you off and what turns you on? Uh, you know what? It's not even the money's not a, a big deal to me because you know I have that. So listen, Stop I'm gonna really trick off. Like who? Who? Listen, I need an OnlyFans boyfriend. So y'all gotta play all the positions. You gotta take my videos. You gotta record. If I need you to make a TikTok, I don't wanna hear no complaints. Wait Clean a minute, cook. <laughs> I know you too. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I think we've got something to say too after this. Go ahead. <laughs> Oh, you don't anymore? You, oh, okay. Okay, so you make videos, right? Yes. Okay. Right. Oh. So, 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 so you need a Wait. guy to shoot like like adult content with? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I, All right, I, fair enough. My question is: Is he the one recording or the one actually doing Smashing. the work oh. and oh. recording? Oh, oh, you have to record. You have to hold the camera. So, so, so you tell me he has to hold the camera while he watches another nigga fuck you? No, 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 no. no. What? No. I mean, if he if he likes it, but. No, I'm asking. That's your criteria. Oh, as long as he's the one pause on that one. Crazy pause, nigga. You okay that's with some it? That's some crazy. Yeah. Shit. But pretty much, he has to have confidence in the way he's fucking you. For sure. That's okay. A one. Okay. All right. Camera so, so you're a spicy star. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. <laughs> Fair enough. Right. What about you? All right. So you're saying what turns me on and what turns me off? Yeah, on first date. Okay. Um, bad hygiene. You cannot have bad hygiene. You better have good smelling breath. You just better be clean, smell good. You sh should have showered. Um, and then what turns me on is someone who can carry a conversation. Uh, maybe someone who doesn't talk too much about themselves. And we can equally go back and forth and engage in like, you know, like something like an intellectual conversation or, you know, be able to even hold himself if he's drinking. So that's another thing. Like you need to not like get sloppy. I'm not going to lie. Hygiene is good. definitely a number one thing that girls have a problem with. And look, it's simple. Just put on some, on some uh, cologne. We, we walked into, into, into the studio, right? What do you smell? My cologne, right? 
It's nah, easy. Nah, nah, nah. But niggas don't be taking showers. Yeah, though. they be just spraying. <laughs> <and all that's laughs> nah, but like, but like, you can't spray it all. After taking a shower though, just put some cologne on. Like, it's not that that, that crazy. And don't take dirty clothes from the hamper <laughs> and spray cologne on it because what some kind of, of y'all you know that. still smell that. Yes, <laughs> so guys wait, will literally wait, wash their have. balls. Yes. and take and that's it. Yo, hold on, hold on. I know niggas from the hood that don't do that shit. So, those some dirty motherfuckers. Those dirty niggas. I'm sorry. Look, for real. Been on the block I feel like a lot of men literally will like smell bad and not even know that they smell bad. Yeah. Like they just don't. Nah, hell nah. No, it's a fact. You can smell yourself. No, no you can't. Yeah. I, I wish you could. I w- yeah. Nah, you can smell Ask yourself. Ask most girls. So. Like it's, it, I wish it was as simple as just putting on deodorant. Wait a minute. So you can tell if you smell? Yes. Yeah. So I, every woman here can tell if they smell. I can tell yeah. if I smell. Sure. But they For might sure. not think Ab- that other people can smell it. Above and below. I would hope so. He said above and below. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. I mean, I I will say this because we're in a unique position where we talk to hundreds of women, but we also coach a hundred thousands of men at this point. And I will say, man, there is a hygiene problem with with a lot of guys, man. Like a lot of dudes don't they they don't they don't shower, they don't dress well, they don't even know what cologne is. A lot of the times, they don't know what skincare is. A lot of them don't wear deodorant, so. Yeah, this is something that I've, it's a growing complaint that I've seen from many women on the show. It's like kind of something that I didn't realize. Cause like when you're a clean dude, you think, all right, well, everyone showers and washes yeah. their balls. All but right. then you realize, okay, I talked to all these girls. Then at the same time, I talked to all these guys. Okay, you guys are not showering. What the hell's going on? Yeah. So, and you don't shave your balls. Wash yeah. your hands after you use the restroom, please, because <laughs> there is so much nasty shit. And then, and then don't try to touch me after you haven't washed your hands. That's yes. really nasty. <laughs> and also, I will ask you, know. you to wash also, your hands. Check your teeth. Look into the camera and smile, and make sure <laughs> that your your teeth are clean. That there's no crumbs. Can, I, can we say a prayer? Them. Like I feel sorry for what you've been through. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> no, no, I, I, really do. I really do. Like I really want. Like, I used to think it was Leaf, bro. Like, I, uh, sorry, Leaf. I used to think it was Cap, but it's like yeah. no. It, it's it, like at this point, hundreds of girls, same complaints. Every show, they at smell, least one or two people. To their talk about are clo- their yeah. clothes are dirty, and they don't own cologne. Or, and and I was just like, damn, like this is like a common. You, you know, the problem is though, like you could you can't smell yourself business. like everyone else can smell you. Yeah, like you, you just can't. Here, so. Here's the other thing too, like like um, because I know you're from the city, and you know obviously guys from New York City typically are a little bit more fashion forward, clean. They dress yeah. well, whatever. Bro, nah, I nah, mean, nah, nah, other nah, other places nah, in the nah, country nah. ain't like I'm that. I'm not from the city. I'm not from the city. There's a difference. There'd be some dirty niggas in New York. I'm from the flossy. We different. We flossy. So it's a whole different, whole different thing. But guys in general from New York are just more fashion forward than other parts of the country is what I'm trying yeah. to say. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you go, like, obviously we're here in Miami, right? Like, like yeah. it's just a certain, like, you, you, you're you just not going to be a dirty guy a lot of the times, especially when a competitive marketplace like this. But like, you go to other parts of the country, man, like, dudes really be on some shit. I don't know, man, what it is. So it wasn't until the girls came in and then I started, like, putting the data with the girls and then talking back to the guys like, yo, Y'all, how often y'all shower? Oh, like three, four times a week. I was like, oh shit. Okay. Yo, the girls oh weren't lying. Oh, the girls weren't crazy, lying. Bro. So yeah. that's bad, bro. Yeah, that's it's strange. Bigger, bro. Nina, what about you? So one thing that turns me on about a guy when I'm on a date is if he has good manners. So you know he pulls a chair for you so that you can 